So 78 St James Street is a really interesting building. It's formed of two distinct elements. Uh, about 20% of the front of the building is a grade two star listed building from the 1830s, 1840s. And then the rest of it, the other 80% is a, a relatively modern office building from the late 90s. And, um, and we were uh, retrofitting this building to be very modern grade A office accommodation, but we've got this wonderful character space uh, at the front, which is this 200 year old part. So we wanted to get the two to mesh together uh, and provide great modern office accommodation in, in the larger element and the modern element and then fill the heritage spaces with amenity for the tenants to, to all enjoy. That in itself created a few challenges. Um, we've got to, got to work around this, this heavily listed, very decorative, decorative building, but it, we have created some wonderful character spaces in there, which we've, uh, which we've restored. We've got a business lounge in the old morning room. We've used the whole areas to create workout spaces massage rooms. And then up on, on, on top of the building, we've created this uh, wonderful roof terrace space, which is for everyone in the building to enjoy. So there's a lot going on in this building. It really is pushing the boundaries of, of what an office building can be. Because we have got these two parts of the building, it creates challenges actually finding your way around. And um, we try to make the journey through the building as intuitive as possible. To, to find your way around to all these different parts of the building where you're constrained by the, the, the route through the heritage spaces, uh, it needs a really, really clear and concise signage strategy so that people can get in and lift, get out of lift and find a way around. So we partnered with Endpoint and Square and Partners to come up with a, a really catchy um, signage package that also looks slick and modern because at the end of the day, this is a, uh, a modern office building. I think the Endpoint team have been very good at coming up with uh, innovative solutions to tackling the challenge of, 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 of two buildings joined together and some, some wonderful graphics which form part of that wayfinding strategy. Now you walk into the building and it becomes quite clear which direction you need to go into, whether you're coming in from the main entrance, whether you're coming in from the back and, and, and as a cyclist down into the changing rooms. Um, it's, a, it's, a, it's a really good intuitive um, wayfinding pack that we've now got in place. And I've really enjoyed working with the Endpoint team, generally lovely people, which is always a, a, is always a good start when you're working with suppliers. One of the things we've noticed actually when people, we've shown a lot of other developers and landlords around the space and tenants, and one of the things they often gets commented on is the sign is particularly in the basement areas and, and lots of people get their phones out and take photos of it, uh, other landlords and developers, and um, it's clearly seen as, as, a, as a really good wayfinding package for other people who are wanting to replicate. So, Imitation is the best form of flattery, as they say.